Hey guys, it's my day. Welcome back to my channel. So I am a teensy weensy embarrassed about the haul I have to show you guys today, but at the same time, I am super excited. If you have been with my channel for a hot moment, you would know that I love planners, planner supplies, and stationery and everything related to like home office. I am absolutely obsessed. So of course, I took the upcoming spring season as an excuse to raid the Target $1 and $3 section and Michaels when they first put out their spring stuff. I have so many products that I want to get done before the spring comes. I'm hoping that these new goodies will motivate me to kick my butt into gear to do some of those, spring cleaning, etc, etc. So hopefully this will inspire you guys to get going on that stuff as well. So if you want to see the goodies that I got, you're in the right place. Just keep on watching. All right, so we're going to start with my little goodies from Michaels because there's less of them and it's just going to get easier to get through. All right, so I first want to start off with these amazing notebooks. How cute are these? These are like a super mini size. Actually, they're not too many, but they're like a pretty mini size. I love notebooks like this, the fact that they're metallic, the fact that they are small, and I love that these were a dollar. So this was a huge deal. I go through notebooks like crazy, and sometimes it's too much for me to carry like my big notebook around. So this was super handy, and I hope you guys can get your hands on these because these are adorable. The next set of things I got was these adorable lipstick, I guess just empty note cards. These were $1.50. I really think these are so adorable and of course because you can never have too many thank you cards I got these adorable thank you cards in gold and polka dots I also got these really cute page flags for planners and then on the other side there are these stickers that come in all these sorts of colors so there's 115 pieces in this so there's a couple sheets of each and also got more of the stickers from the same brand. You can see on one side there's those stickers. And on this side, they're just these large blank stickers, which I think is really perfect for like planner space and things like that. And I got these really cute page flags that come with like the traditional page flag shape and also these chat message shapes, which I thought was adorable. And they also come in pink, which I also got. Of course, I think I'm already using one of these staples, but not staples. These are so cute. These pink and white little clips that we have here. Ooh, and I almost forgot the washi tape that I got. Gold glittery metallic washi tape. As you can see how glittery that is. A lilac, because it's my favorite color, glittery washi tape and a blue and pink striped washi tape, which I thought was really cute. And my favorite part about this, I know this is not stationary or planner related at all, but I got this really cute glass hot pink water bottle that says drink me for I think something like $3 because I got it 20% off and it was originally like $4, something like that. But this is so cute and I think the company's name is Ashlyn. I'll try to link it down below. This is like the only one left. And I had been searching all week for a really cute water bottle and I couldn't find anything. So I just thought I'd mention that if you see that at your Michaels because I am really enjoying this. So just a note. Also another thing that I got that I was really excited about was this tropical paper pad. I love pads of paper as you can see. Just gonna flip through this. I love this for projects and stuff like that. I've already been toying around with it and kind of lighting some notebooks I had already gotten. So I'm really enjoying because, this. you know, the other notebooks weren't enough. This I actually got, I think, at Home Goods. And it is this beautiful gold and white notebook. It's almost, I think, like a soft leather. Oh my god. And you just, it's a magnetic closure so beautiful like I couldn't leave it in the store it was like calling my name it was like my day my day don't leave me and I was just having an internal battle because I have so many notebooks but I couldn't let it go I was obsessed with it and it also has a really beautiful like gold tassel as well as a page marker sold sold I love it when it closes like this I was sold 
All right, moving on to the Target haul that probably won't ever end. This is my life. These are wooden paper, no, sorry, they're wooden flower clips. <gasps> my, one of my flowers came off. One of my flowers came off. I was gonna have to hot glue it back on, but that sucks. Anyways, these are wooden flower clips, and I was going to use them for decorations on this frame, but I'm going to have to glue that back up. I just thought it was such a cute and fun way to give, like, desk life, but now this is becoming more complicated than I thought. All right, I'm going to have to technically figure this out, but these wooden flowers were everything to me especially the colors so i can't believe one of them fell off. actually i can i paid three dollars for this entire thing but i'm gonna have to hot glue it back on now oh well all right on to the next thing i purchased were these beautiful patterned scissors if you can't tell there's like a black and polka dot pattern on these scissors and this is like a very cute coral pink of color. course more note cards this one these were all a dollar and this were just plain floral note cards and these were note cards that said hello in all different colors and these were more thank you cards I never have enough thank you cards Got neon chalk markers for my chalkboard and these really cute spring inspired pencils these really adorable kind of cardboard themed looking page flags for a planner so adorable i was all over that. this is really embarrassing but more note cards except for this one's black with a pink heart and came with pink envelopes and all about this is that i can write with it on white gel pens some which i did get but i love black cards because i don't see this very often so i like that also sticky notes and page flags this one says thoughts i thought that was so cute to kind of put on the dashboard of my planner so and these really cute sprinkle themed sticky notes and these are heart shaped clips that came with that more page flags except these are really adorable these have like different sayings on it let me see it says i love this buy this remember this gotta have this and check it out so i really like that for if i'm looking through like a magazine i know so old school if i'm looking through a magazine or just if i save things into my planner and stuff like that I love putting that in or like ideas and things so it's just nice to mark this up and I just really like the font and design. Ooh, more writing utensils. So these were pens that were floral inspired for the spring. So this was a pack of two which are really cute. And these kind of like the page flags like I showed had that kind of cardboard and gold theme so those match and are really cute i'm hoping that they write well but i'm really pleased with the design of them so obviously in the theme of writing utensils i got a pack of sharpie pens and chalk markers and this galaxy marker pen so i've heard a lot about galaxy marker pen that it can write on a lot of different surfaces i haven't tried one yet however if you are at target this was in the dollar to three dollar section and they do have a galaxy marker pen that is in the normal section of target like in their normal pen stationery section and that was like six or seven dollars and that came in a different packaging that didn't have a polka dot so if you wanted to try out the pen but you didn't want to pay the seven dollars those are two different pen companies i also got this really cute adorable pack of scented glitter gel pens with really cutesy stickers i'm not so cutesy but this was so adorable that i couldn't let it go and i needed a new hole punch and this was mint green so that was a no-brainer. I also got this really cool metal ruler. I mean, it's not really cool. To me, I'm a nerd, so I think it's really cool. But this cool, like, not too heavy, not too light metal ruler has some board on the back. But I love this to lay flat. And this, I really liked. This was, I think, 3 or $5. 
this was three dollars and this really could be used for anything like i said i know it's not technically planner supply related but this also came with mint green stripes and they were almost gone so i snatched it up i love this for the beach for three bucks if i needed to put sunblock or toiletries in here for travel or this could just be like a really cool thing to put in like a tote for the summer i just thought for three dollars like it's so universal for the summer because you don't want things to get wet so this was one of my favorite purchases of the entire haul because i just found it and was like wow like that's really convenient so this was in the dollar section the dollar three dollar section so if you see this snatch it up because i think it's going to be pretty handy come summertime all right so this was a dry erase board that came with its dry erase marker that says hello and with the blush and white stripes blush next to lilac is also one of my favorite colors so this had to go home with me <laughs> so i got two of these ring binders for three dollars each i was looking everywhere for covers like this that weren't going to break the bank and these were so cute and they pop out anything you want and for three bucks i snatched up both because both patterns i couldn't resist i really need to update which i can do an entire video on my planner system i'm working on creating my own inserts for my planner just because if you saw my Kate Spade planner review that I did a couple months ago, as much as I love that planner, it is just not functioning the way it needs to be functioning as a planner, aka it's not useful to me anymore in the exact layout that it's in. It used to suit me for undergrad, but right now in my life it does not suit me anymore and I'm thinking that I might even need to have two planners. I'm not sure about that, but I need to start looking into a way to better my planning and how to maximize my day and just the writing space in that planner it's just not working it's a great planner and i suggested it for all the reasons that i mentioned in that video i will link it down below but the needs of my life have changed so drastically in the past couple months that i've just been feeling like a disorganized mess because it's just not the planner that i need right now in my life so that's what i'm working on right now so this is going to be an integral part of that project the other thing I saw, which was is also like the last one, was the, the inserts for this planner. It comes with six of the dividers, 78 weekly pages, 18 monthly pages, and this is $3. So you could just get one of these and one of these and put these in. This is what I might do for the second planner. I'm not sure yet. I also like the fact they have many dividers, so I guess take out those many dividers, trace them onto my other paper, make new dividers. And I like the month layout because I didn't know if I really wanted to go through the process of printing out monthly layouts for my second planner so we'll see how I use this but this was definitely really useful and affordable so if you're on the lookout for a cheap planner option this is a great deal all right so enough about planners for now <laughs> so this is the chalk sign that has like a frame stand on the back this was also three dollars and it has like a gold detailing of the frame i love this because it's not just a standalone chalkboard or a chalkboard that you have to hang it looks finished it looks done and i was going to put the wooden flowers on top to decorate it and just keep it as kind of like a motivational board i'm not going to really think right like a to-do list on it or anything but just to do some sketches or some chalk art or something like that or just to keep on with like motivational quotes on my desk i think that this would be pretty useful i just saw it and i was like mine dying of chalk i got this really adorable chalk calendar for three dollars it also came with chalk if you didn't have any i thought this is going to be perfect because i wanted something that was like a large calendar i didn't want a dry erase board for them i wanted something that i could erase fill in the days fill in the months and kind of just have something in large to see because i don't have something like that right now i'm usually look, used to looking at calendars in my planner or my phone or on a smaller computer screen but i want to be able to see my calendar up front close and personal in a very large size so next i have folders are these not the most gorgeous folders ever there's three in each pack these were a dollar and it also came with labels this was the other set that i got again gold and white my favorite and the other ones on the back three as well and i was so excited when i saw these because i was at home goods and i saw the most gorgeous like neon rose gold lined folders because i need to do some filing 
and they were about six dollars each and i was like oh it's not that bad but do i really want it for folders like how much do i really use them like i did like i was debating with myself about it and kind of part of me which wanted to get it but then when i saw these at target i was so glad that i waited because it was such a good deal and i only really needed six of these anyway so i just almost want to buy more because the design is just so adorable so maybe i can instagram me using these or something because these are oh and i have another set Ooh la la on this side and then this pink and white triangle divide on the other. So yeah, I did get three sets. <laughs> I lied. <laughs> this is more planner stuff. So this concept I thought was really cool because this planner is like a planner larger than life. It's not really a planner. I mean, it's like one big sticky note of 30 sheets of a planner pad. I haven't really seen something like this. Maybe I'm just super late to the game, but I've definitely never used something like this. It's divided morning, afternoon, and evening, kind of to-do list, not exactly by hour, but I like the layout of this. I like that you can fill in the time and date. I like this as kind of like a very zoomed in part of my day. I know this isn't something that I'll be using every day, but I think this is something that would be great for a day that I have a lot going on that may not fit in a planner or just something that I really want to see magnified for whatever reason. So to accompany that, I got this really cute clipboard meet notebook oops, style board with hot pink. It's kind of my style, but I just really like the functionality of it because I could put this on the clipboard and kind of keep it on my desk. I also like the fact that it has a ginormous notepad in it. And whenever I'm in bed furiously writing notes or ideas, I never have like a flat surface that I can use. So this is probably something that's gonna go in like the huge pile of books behind me and like next to my bed, uh, just so I can be able to have something to write on and not be crouching over on my bed and getting ink all over the place. All right guys, so that concludes this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed so you won't miss any videos. And as always, I will catch you guys in my next one. Bye guys.